This video is about how you can make some good money trading price patterns in the Forex. One of the first things you should do uh, planning a trade on the Forex or in the commodities or any market for that matter is find out where the trend is. As you can see right here this has been an uptrend for quite some time going back to January, February of 06. It's been climbing steadily and it's topping off. We've got a, a topping action here sometimes called a head and shoulders. You can tell it's coming to an end. It's going to take a break for sure. And look at these indicators right here. This is going down. This is matching the highs right here but it's not showing any strength here and look at this true strength indicator this is taking quite a plunge so you should have seen this one coming and you could have taken advantage of it I'll go to the uh, hourly now and show you how you could have made out there was a really good pattern there uh, I'll show you what it is okay this is a close-up of the weekly chart uh, this is last week right here a really good drop okay now I'm going to switch over again to the uh, 60 minute chart and show you how you could have really made a killing on this there's around 400 or so pips right in here you could have gotten a good share of it this is the 60 minute chart right here uh, bring it in Here's my one, a two, and a three pattern right here. I really like these patterns. If they're done right, they pay off very handsomely. This number two went over here and it broke below right here. At about 1.5400. And it went down to in this area right here. Uh, this is today's date right here. This is um, August 11th, moving in right here. If you could have gotten out somewhere around here at about 150, that's 400 pips. Uh, a mini contract, $400 on a standard contract, that's $4,000 for one day. That's good trading. Okay, and also you might want to notice here, it's a little channel formed up right here. You could have gotten a better trade here. Uh, we'll put the channel in here. Here's the other part to it. Now the way to play this is you can put a buy up here. If you notice down here it doesn't justify a buy, but it sure does indicate a good possibility of a break to the downside, and this is what happened. It broke down. This indicator right here supports this. It also supports this one, two, three here. This two strength indicator. You got lots of support here for the downside. Nothing really going for the upside. And this is how it's done. You find a price pattern. Find out where the trend is and trade it. And in this particular case for the Euro US dollar. Uh, topping out and it's going down how far down that remains to be seen but you could have made a really good deal on this one these are quite common especially this pattern here this is my favorite for trading in Forex and commodities um, it's, it's good to have there's another little support you could have added to your trade right here look at this this broke to the downside look at that holy mackerel Okay, you can find out all about these uh, price patterns at my futuresblog.com. There is an ebook there in PDF format. Anybody can open it up. It's all about how to find, recognize, and trade price patterns. How to plan your trade, trade your plan, and you can do quite well. When I was an active trader, I done uh, really good. Um, had a bit of an incident six years ago and got took me out of it, but that's another story. But I still love to watch these trades. I'm giving some serious thought to getting back into trading, 
But until then, I'm going to show you how you can make some money. If you follow a uh, plan, find a price pattern like this. Um, there's another one that could have formed up here. One, two, three. And if it went back up, you could have made something out of that. But it didn't do that. It went down. And for these to work, you must have your indicator support. This is a really good one here. I found it on this particular uh, trading platform. MACD, uh, the one I used to use all the time. I kind of like this one because it's kind of a neat looking one. But it supports these kind of moves. And that is essential to trading price patterns. If they don't have support with your indicators, chances are you're going to take a hit. So until next time, I'll uh, see you on my blog, myfuturesblog.com. Good trading to everyone. I wanted to point out uh, one thing I should have mentioned a little bit earlier. Um, when you're planning your trade, you trade with a trend. Well, all trends will come to an end sooner or later. This one's been going up for some time. It goes back to 06, as you can see. Been strong all the way up. Strong all the way up with these indicators. But all trends come to an end. So what do you do? You make the best of it. There's trades all in here. You can see it's uh, topping out. This would be a kind of a crapshoot here. There's a one, a two, a three on a weekly. You could have made the best of. But look at these indicators. They're going down. This says this trend, uptrend is over, or at least taking a pretty good pause. Uh, I'm guessing it's going to go down for a while. There's strong support here. There's another support point here. And all the way down. How far is down? Well, that remains to be seen. We could do a, throw a Fibonacci on there, but that's another uh, video maybe. Um, the price patterns, you can find them again in that book I have on my site. It's a free ebook I wrote uh, maybe 10 or so years ago. It's all about price patterns and how to trade them and how to plan a trade and some money management. There's quite a bit in there. It's a free one to pick up. Um, good trading to all.